early in the tournament. Right we, next to it, there's a California sign. So we've got the California contingent here as Kansas and California square off against one another. This has to be great experience going into the college level. It's almost like an NCAA meet because of the representation from so many different states here, very much like the university uh, level that you will face in Division I championships. Cooper and Jeremy Lay tied up right now as we start action in the 189-pound class. Cooper, of course, uh, likes to go in for the double leg. And as Mike uh, mentioned, he is a cradle man, likes that far side cradle. It's funny, he said that he knew California would do well when they came to the championships. He said if he had one change he would make in the tournament, though, he would let all of the state champions come, regardless of their uh, uh, standing uh, as far as seniors, juniors, or sophomores. Well, I had the privilege to watch Terry Kulat from Jefferson Morgan High School here in Pennsylvania. He's a sophomore, and he has to be probably the best sophomore in the United States. And it would be interesting to see how the underclassmen would have done in this tournament uh, because there's a lot of great ones out there uh, that, uh, you know, guys like Ty Moore here in Pennsylvania, they won two state championships, and then everyone moved out of their weight class. So they would have a chance to really establish how really good they are by coming, uh, you know, maybe after their junior year or senior year into this national championship. More, uh, Cooper trying to get in on a leg as uh, he and Lay go off the mat with 47 seconds remaining here in the first period. No score. Both wrestlers feeling each other out. Very cautious at this point. Lay tries to shoot in on a leg, but it's countered nicely by Cooper. Cooper and Lay now tied up, looking for an angle. Still 0-0, zero, zero, and I know the referees are uh, looking very closely at stalling warnings at this point. They both go off the mat again with 10 seconds remaining in the first period. Like two big cats feeling each other out of there. Well, Cooper with 51-0 and 0 this year from California has to be considered the favorite in this match against Jeremy Lay from Kansas. And it's uh, a deferral by uh, Zach Cooper, who's wearing the red ankle bands. So Jeremy Lay with the green ankle bands decides that he will start the second period in the down position. Cooper had a good match with George Young from Louisiana in the uh, semifinals. And uh, Lay uh, was up against uh, Alan Hazel from Maine, or I should say Michigan, in the, uh, his semifinal. Cooper throws him to the mat. Still trying to gain control. He's got him in a cradle. But got he him in a cradle and he's trying to turn him over. Cooper. And uh, Jeremy lays in a lot of trouble right now. Cooper showed a lot of strength because he was very he close to two being... points for the near fall. Right, he was close and he showed strength to turn, lay around, and get the two points. One point for the escape now for Jeremy Lay with a minute 28 remaining, second period. Boy, that was close. Yes, the first action that we really have felt in this uh, first or second period of this 189-pound uh, match. Both in the standing position once again, the neutral position. Lay trying to shoot in on a leg countered once again by Cooper. Both wrestlers waiting for the other one to be the aggressor. A lot of blocks, a lot of thinking going on in this match. They go off the mat once again and they'll return to the middle of the mat. The referee in the 189-pound um, uh, division is Frank Volcano from right here in western Pennsylvania. He runs that California State Wrestling Tournament every year.
Cooper and Lee still trying to make something happen here. They go off the court, uh, off the mat, with 39 seconds remaining. Well, we're second period. We are on a court. Yeah, the <laughs> basketball court here at the University of Pittsburgh, but uh, they got a mat in the center of the floor. Yeah. If they went onto the court, it might hurt a little bit. Not a Big that. East <laughs> basketball game. We're in the National High School Finals. Where we you have to qualify by winning a state championship. Only championship of its kind going on in high school sports to determine eight All Americans in each weight division. What well, points are hard to come by on this one? It's two to one in favor of Zach Cooper from Canyon High School in California over Jeremy Lay from Hiawatha High School in Kansas. Probably the most conservative match that we've had in the finals so far tonight. Cooper shooting in on a leg. Can't gain an advantage. And that's the end of the second period. Zach Cooper clinging to that two to one lead over Jeremy Lay as we get set for the start of the third period. And Cooper will be in the down position to start this period. I think whoever becomes more aggressive in this third period is going to win this. They've been thinking each other, feeling each other. Now they have to go after each other. Jeremy Lay and Cooper. Cooper trying to stand up. And he gets one point for the escape. He now leads three to one. That might be a big point the way this match has gone. There's no doubt, George, that uh, a point or two, somebody's going to get real aggressive with a minute to go. And if you're up two, uh, you might be able to uh, do some blocking. Both wrestlers tied up. And trying to shoot in on a leg is uh, Jeremy Lay, countered nicely by... Zach Cooper. Cooper now trying to shoot in. Can't get it done with a minute 20 remaining in the third period. They're both off the mat. They'll come back in the neutral position in the center of the mat. Cooper rolls him over on his back. And now Lay is in a lot of trouble. We're Cooper... We're a near fall. Tries to put him down. Not out yet. No, his supporting pins uh, are still his knees inside the circle. Two-point near fall for Zach Cooper. He leads 7-1 to one with 54 seconds remaining. That might be almost insurmountable at this point. Right, and uh, you need to hold someone over five seconds for to get that three-point in the near fall. That was a two-pointer, 7-1 to one so far. Or uh, Mr. Cooper of California. Could be California's first national champ. Cooper. Watch that leg. 43 seconds remaining. Cooper still trying to gain the advantage. Turn him over. 30 seconds remaining. Cooper has wrestled like a four-point student, which he is <laughs> tonight. Very heady match, knowing what he could do or can't do. Did not make any mistakes. And I want to correct myself on the near fall. I think he got two points for a takedown, not the near. Uh, right, you can't get a near fall if your opponent is out of bounds. Right, and earlier I mentioned that also as we get Mr. Cooper become a conservative national champ here at the 189. He decisions Jeremy Lay from Hiawatha High School in Kansas 7-1. to one. So Zach Cooper notches one for uh, California. Zach Cooper, who's got two state titles to his credit, wins the national championship at 189 pounds. And uh, California breaks through, <laughs> gets their gets their first national champ. And uh, we're getting up to the big guys now, George. And the, the heavyweight division is next. <laughs> 
And this should be a great match between Scott Martin and Alan Orton. Right now, let's go to Jim Herbstritt, who's talking with Zach Cooper, the champion at 189 pounds. Thank you, Zach. It was a tremendous win for you. Uh, I never heard of any of the guys in my weight class. I like that the best. You, you're always psyched up for every match. And I knew I saw my coach's guy some of his matches. So I just now tried to stop his single and take it to him. You had an almost perfect match there, and you had a very good opponent as well. Well, I think my biggest strength is my defense, because then no, no one can ever get anything on me. So then all I have to do is just wait until something comes for me. So that's what I do. <laughs> okay. Zach, congratulations. By the way, you're the first winner we've had, the first uh, champion from California. I know. Four guys in the finals and only me. I was really surprised. I thought at least... I thought, I thought we'd at least get two of them to place. I, mean, I was hoping for all of them, but that's the way it goes. Okay, congratulations, Zach. Thanks very much. Take care. Have a good trip back. Thanks. And we'll be back with more wrestling right after this. <laughs> 